Hello, hello, and welcome back once again to Paris. And today we're going to take care of the a permanent break assassination challenge. You don't need to bring anything with you for this one. And we will also be picking up a couple of feats and discoveries, namely a, the key to the auction challenge or discovery and a quick break uh, discovery. And basically that's find the dongle for the laptop in Art Dahlia's, uh, for Dahlia's laptop and sabotage the auction via the laptop. And then we will kill Dahlia by breaking her neck. So right from the start, our first objective will be our secondary target, Victor Novikov. So we're going to make our way into the building yes, and down into the basement. <gasps> which is just under the stairs to the left here so down into the basement area we're down the stairs we're going to wait at the bottom of the stairs for the makeup artist to go past and through the locker room and then we're going to follow him into the locker room where we will find a waiter's disguise so there goes the makeup artist now he's clear he's going to turn right we're going to turn left on the bench here is our disguise and with that now in place we're going to make our way through the basement to the kitchen and up the kitchen stairs to the ground floor and we're going to poison an hors d'oeuvre and we're going to take out Victor's bodyguard and that will then leave us pretty much free and clear to take out Victor very, very quickly. So once we're on the ground floor, we're just going to hang a right through the double doors, down the corridor, hang another quick right through these double doors into this food preparation area. We're going to grab this fire extinguisher and knock out the two waiters real quick with them. And then we're going to hide both of their bodies in the cupboard that's in the far corner. So what we're going to do here is we're going to grab the poison once both the bodies are nicely tucked away. That's just by the window. There we go. And we're going to poison the hors d'oeuvres at the other end of the room, just on this front table right here. And Victor's bodyguard will eat one of these and get sick, and we can eliminate him. We're going to pick up this kitchen knife. That will be today's murder weapon. Like I said, there are about three knives in this room. So once we're all set up and ready to go, we're just going to go into the bathroom across the corridor, hide in the cupboard, and wait for Victor Novikov and his bodyguard to go through their routine. And Victor's no bodyguard will get sick, come to this bathroom, and we can take him out. And it's at this point I'm going to sabotage my silent assassin run. So if you, if you want a silent assassin run, don't kill him. And the rest of this will be a silent assassin. But I like to sabotage my silent assassin's runs. Because I'm weird. So we're going to make our way back into the food preparation room. We're going to stash up the bodyguard's gun. We're going to select our kitchen knife. And we're going to wait patiently behind the door here for Victor Novikov to go through his routine. Make his way back into this room. We're going to shut the door behind him and cut his throat except I forgot to pull out my knife so we're going to break his neck 47. time to find Dahlia Margolis it's so much quicker with the knife so what we're going to do because the cupboard at the co other corner of the room is now full we're just going to hide Novikov's body behind these boxes here now only one other person should come through this room and that would be Helmet Kruger, but he only comes in through one door and then straight out one of the other doors. He doesn't go anywhere over there, so you should be safe. So with Novikov out the way, we are now free to take on the a permanent break challenge. So we're going to make our way back down through the basement and retrieve our suit because getting up to the third floor is probably easiest when you're wearing your suit. Surprisingly, everywhere else. 
getting to a high secure area usually means knocking someone out, getting their disguise or sneaking around a lot. But in Paris, we can just walk boldly up the stairs. So we're back in the locker room now. We're just waiting for this enforcer in his pants to move out of the way. There he goes. We're going to retrieve our suit, make our way back up into the main entrance area upstairs. And we're going to hang a right at the top of the stairs here, through these doors. Hang a right, through these doors. Hang a right, through these doors. Hang a left, into the bathroom. We're here we are with our invitation for the auction. So then we're going to make our way to the outside bar. We're just going to move down off the patio area, up the side of the building, back in the rear side door. And we're going to have to show our invitation to a couple of guards and get frisked. Hence dropping the knife and the gun in the kitchen back there. So for this challenge, what we need to do is locate a dongle for a laptop which will be easy enough uh, we then need to like put to the dongle teacher. into the laptop and sabotage the auction again very very simple Thank and you. then one, sir. we need to kill Dahlia Margolis in the exact same way we've just killed Victor Novikov and that will get us the a permanent sir, break challenge still, I have to do a routine check. So we're just making our way through the frisk so now. We're almost at the top of the stairs. Uh, what we're going to do first of all Thank you. is Please take out Vic, uh, Dahlia's personal bodyguard and Please. the guard that's Please. in her office. Just like we would do in many of the other challenges. The reason we're doing this is just to get mostly Dahlia's personal bodyguard out of the way because we don't want him following her into her other office when we're ready to snap her neck because he stands at the other end of the room facing you so we want him out of the way and the easiest way to do that without getting spotted by anyone is the old overflowing sink trick so we're going to turn on the radio and hide behind the wardrobe take out the guard on duty in the office area as soon as he turns the bloody radio off. And we're going to hide his body and his gun. Rinse and repeat, but this time use the sink instead of the radio. And that will attract Dahlia's bodyguard into the room. And once he's out of the way, we're then free to go and collect the dongle. And find the laptop. So here comes her bodyguard now, and he, he must be a very good bodyguard because he's not even armed, not even a handgun. This guy must be like, excellent at martial arts and hand-to-hand -hand combat. But not too good with his hearing or provisional, provisional vision, peripheral vision even. So with him unconscious and out the way, we're going to hide him in the box as well. We're going to take one of their outfits, just to help us moving around a little bit easier on this top floor. And we're then going to make our way back out into the hallway and through the auction. Basically what we need to do is get into the attic, which is where we are now, but we need to be on the other side. And you can go through the attic area, but there are enforcers. And you'll have to sneak around that a little bit. Is Dahlia or you can just run Supermodel straight through the auction monster. room here. Hang a left. Through this door. Straight across the hallway. Through this door. And you're there. No enforcers, no problems, no nothing. There is one enforcer just over to the right there. But just on the boxes here is the dongle. So that will get you a key to the auction challenge or feet or discovery whatever it is and we just make our way back out through the doors across the hall into the double doors on the left and here is the laptop so we're going to investigate the laptop insert the dongle and sabotage the 
auction. And that will get you the other feat. I can't actually remember what it's called now. A, a, a break or something like that. Short break, something. So now all we've got to do is wait for Dahlia's assistant to notice that the server's gone down. And I've left this bit in because I think it's quite funny how she just discovers it's gone wrong and wait, nopes wait, the what? hell out of there. Server offline? Oh shit! No, 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 that's not good. Okay, okay. Use your stupid head. Uh, what did that IT guy say? Uh, something about uh, uh, tools? No, no, no. Plugins? Oh god, why didn't I listen? Delia is going to kill me. She is literally gonna kill. Huh? I can't do this. No. I have to get out of here. So with her out of the way now, the bodyguard will follow. All we have to do now is wait for Dahlia to notice that the laptop or the the auction has stopped. Come and check the laptop, find out that it's been sabotaged in some way. And the reason we're waiting here is because we're going to sneak up behind her and snap her neck. And that will get you the permanent break challenge. Well, Haley, you doe-eyed rube. Both targets are down. Great work. Now head towards an exit. So that's it. All we've got to do is hide her body behind the desk there a little bit. We're going to make our way back into her office area. We're going to retrieve our suit from her bathroom. Because, again, this is probably the easiest way to get up and down between the floors here. Uh, or this part of the building, anyway. So all we've got to do now is run towards an exit. All the way back down to the ground floor. Uh, I'm going to take the main entrance exit as I normally do when I'm wearing my suit. So we're going to run all the way around, retracing our steps exactly the way we went up. All the way back into the entrance hall. Out into the foyer. Through the front garden area where the fountain is. And through the main gate. So there you go, that's one more assassination challenge, a permanent break, and two more feats and discoveries taken care of. I have been Anubis, and I will see you all in the next video.